Now I've been rationing out the Five Nights at Freddy's fan games, but this one actually is at the top of a lot of people's list. It's very highly rated, and apparently, Candy, like the character, was made and used before Five Nights at Candy's was ever actually a game. So I'm gonna give this one a try. I don't know if I'm gonna get through all Five Nights of it. Candy's Burgers and Fries. Family's restaurant looking for security guard during the night shift. 12 a.m. to six. Okay. Whoa. Hello. Yes? We're probably gonna be a lot busier from now on. Um, you may have heard about the place called Freddy Fazbear's Pizzeria, right? Ooh, ooh, ooh. Uh, yeah, they got shut down yesterday. Oh, no. I don't know why, though. Uh, probably something like uh, tax fraud or such, you know? Oh, sure, yeah. Uh, I never really liked that place. I always had a bad feeling about it, you know? Uh, their pizzas weren't even that good. In order to save power, of course, all the lights will at night be turned off. But don't worry, we have a desk lamp in the office that you can use. If you open up the maintenance panel, you'll be able to view the restaurant through the security cameras. And the cameras all have a neat feature, which is night vision mode. These cameras were the cheapest we could get, so the night vision isn't that accurate. But it does retain the colors. I don't... Is good, I guess. What are you talking um, about good? You toggle the night vision by activating the camera you're already on. And, uh, by the way... We have a security feature in the restaurant that limits how much power can be used after hours. Uh, don't fall asleep, and have a good night. Thank you! I'm sure everything will go wonderfully, and nothing will go wrong at all! I'm gonna be okay here! Okay! <laughs> this is actually a really interesting mechanic with, like, the night vision being... Like, you have to activate it on command here. That doesn't seem to be much of an indication of how much I'm power I'm using. Hey! Excuse me! Hey, wait a minute. Oh, God, no! Oh, no. Oh, hey! Wait, that's... That was there! What do I do? Oh, hey! <laughs> Hello! Oh, you look so adorable and cute! Oh, no. Oh. Oh! Oh, God. How are they gonna get through there anyway? It's a window! To the wall! To the go the frick away! Where'd he go? Ready, go. <laughs> Frick. It's okay. <laughs> oh, robot scrapped. Freddy Fazbear is closing. After being open a few short weeks, it's scrapped. Oh, good. So long as they stay there, I should be relatively okay. So I'm just gonna camp out and nap. No one better sneak up on me. <laughs> Candy and Cindy are stupid names. <laughs> oh, you're such adorable little kitties. And this guy's such a nightmare fuel thingamabobber. And then there's like a picture of a pe This is like a penguin. There's like a picture of a monkey over there. I don't know if you're all friends or something, but I'd like it if you just went the fuck away and never bothered me ever in your life. What is the dinging? Why is there dinging? That is me! I see a pink mustache back there! That is so a pink mustache! Look! How's a pink mustache back on there? I wonder why it's in this room. The particularly spooky room. Oh boy. You stay right there! I don't much care for all this wander wooing. Wander woo. I don't know how they're gonna be diving through the window like that, but I ain't taking a risk. I'm gonna run out of power. I know for a fact. I'm gonna run right out of power. You sons of bitches, you sassy Sues, dancing all over the place with your glowing eyeballs. Oh. Oh, that's not good. Okay. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh. Oh, okay. Where, 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 where? Oh, God. Okay. We're okay. Oh, good. Okay. Oh, it's only 4 a.m. Load of malarkey. Oh, God. Where'd she go? Okay, there she is. This is like a goddamn nightmare trying to hunt him down in the dark. Just looking for the glowing eyeballs among the static. This is not okay with this. Oh, come on, 5 a.m. Go a little quicker now. Anything would be more helpful. Oh, I'm a scared little b- Oh! Yay! Uh. Woo! I did it. Okay. Loading feed? What does that mean? What is this? Oh, God. What is this, some sort of- Oh, hey! Uh! 
Uh. Hey, whoa, hey, whoa, whoa. Hi, buddy. Hey, how's it going there? Oh, God, you're so scary. Why do I gotta do this again? What do you- Ah, fuck you! Oh, you sack of crap! That was really good! That was superly well done! I can see why this is one of the highest rated fan games! That was amazing! I love that! Sometimes in the morning, we find them in the strangest oh. places. Oh. <laughs> uh, so you may see them walking around while you're here. Hi! Sonic will try to uh -oh. seek out the car <laughs> What was with the monkey? After that day, uh, the animatronics don't really seem to function properly around adults. Uh, especially not around the staff. We kind of had an accident about a month ago. It seems to have, like, traumatized their systems or something like that. Uh, anyway, we replaced the faulty animatronic with some brand new ones. Yeah, so he's stored way in the back until we can get someone to fix him. Anyway, if I were you, I'd keep the other ones at a distance and, uh, use the doors if you have to. Um, that would be it for now. Uh, ha have a good night. Oh, <laughs> thank you for the message about the violence that's going to be enacted upon me. Hey, monkey! How are you doing? I did not know that I would need to worry about you. So when he moves away from there, I'm going to be seeing him in my... ...periff. Oh, God, I'm seeing him in my periff! Ah! One near the kitchen, one near the entrance to the party rooms, and then just Jojo. I mean, I guess if that's all that's there on the second night, I don't expect it to be too difficult because I kind of know the pattern at this point. I mean, I'm pretty familiar with these types of games. Doth I need to remind thine ears that I am the king of some Five Nights at Freddy's game. Maybe. Maybe I shouldn't brag about that too loudly. They'll come and take my crown off my head. I guess I wouldn't be in trouble unless I saw eyeballs over there. And I know I'm gonna be seeing eyeballs around me sometime soon. I also read that the developer, like, rebuilt this game from the ground up and didn't use any resources. Hey there! Oh, jeez. <laughs> oh god, I'm not gonna be able to see their eyes because they're gonna be towards, towards, turns towards me! Why does the ding dong and keep ding danging? And why is there a pangan? I'm tired of being scared in the dark. Also, I shouldn't be yelling. I'm waking up my brother and my mom. Oh, I'm such a douchey child. There's gotta be like a separate animatronic that, that uh, goes for the, the center window and, and something else that I don't have to worry about just yet. Come on! Any minute now! Oh god, I did it again, I was just yelling. God, I can't stop it. Hooray! Oh lord. I don't think I want to go to the feed. I don't even know where the hell this is going towards. No video? Oh god, no. Oh no. Oh! Hey, no! Oh, 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 no! Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, oh! I need to shut up. That look horrible. You know that character that the kids can draw on? You know, uh, blank. I think. Blank. This guy? Uh, yeah, I always really liked that one. Oh, it's, oh, it's a brilliant concept. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, yeah. His suit is made out of some special plastic stuff, I think, uh, that the kids can come in and, you know, uh, grab a crayon and uh, start drawing on his head or his arms. Uh, some of the others here Whoa. think that he looks a bit scary. Hey. Uh, that From what we can tell, uh, his head got a real beating, so he might act a little uh, strange. Um, like, he sometimes tried to get into the office through the window. And he even managed to crack the glass slightly <laughs> uh, Yeah, if he leaves the drawing room, just shut the window door so he doesn't hey. break the glass. Are you trying to tell me that one of the animatronics has brain damage? Because that seems a little unplausible. So blank is supposed to come through my windows. <laughs> Whoa. Hi, friend. Oh god, Blanky Blank. He is my least favorite, so... Oh, hey, whoa! God damn, you are acting. I got a damage to trust you! Okay, it's almost a damn shame I'm so good at this game. I'm never gonna experience another jump scare as long as I live because I'm so damn... Oh, hi, Jojo. Alright. Hi! You know, I'm still wondering who you are. 
I don't want to call you Mo. Oh, Mo. I don't think I want to. Ah, it's not good. God. I do not want to die from a Jojo to the face. You know, I say that I'm good at this game, but I know I'm going to get plenty of deaths when night four and five roll around. Bro whoa, 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 wait. Whoa. That's not okay. Oh, God. Fuck you. Oh, okay. That was all. That's not so bad. I shouldn't have spoken so soon. Okay, so I'm gonna close that just in case. I don't know if that's gonna do anything for me. All I know is that's gonna chew up a lot of power. I mean, I can turn it off on the rig and let it die down and then put it back on. That would chew a little less power, I guess. I don't know. I don't know the stratagems. Hope no one hurts their feety weedies on anything. Just like my fingy wingies. Being all out show. Oh, hey, whoa, hey. So what was the cause of that? What was the cause of that misconstrued aggression? Lanky Blue doesn't want to mess with me. I've been climbing and working out. Look at all my muscles. I am so getting fit. I'm still a big blob of flab. I saw that. Thank you. So I guess Momo just doesn't want to play anymore. Okay, never mind, Momo wants to play. Hey, how's it going? Someone heard me talking. Someone told me that there was actually, uh... Me as an animatronic in this game, or someone made fan art of it. I saw a picture of me as an animatronic. Oh, I don't know what to do about you. Oh, he's so cute. Oh, he just wants to go to the bathroom. Oh, what an adorable. Oh, what an adorable little nightmare. Hey, wow, Momo, you're moving. I did not know that was something I should be worried about. Okay, good. Um, can I get you anything? You don't have any eyeballs. So I don't know if you're staring at me from the darkness, but I can only assume that it's a lovingly long gaze. Well, this isn't a good sign. I seem to be using up everything I could possibly- Yay! It didn't matter! I'm a winner nonetheless. Good for me. Oh, we're so late at night. What? What, did the police come in? Oh, hey, 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 hey. You having a trouble there? You got a crick in the neck? Hey, what are you doing so close to- Whoa. Oh, okay then. It's really interesting. Like, by far, this probably is the one that's trying to be the most faithful recreation of Five Nights at Freddy's. Well, not recreation, but adding on to the universe in its own way, in the same theme, you know what I mean? Uh, so remember that previous security guard I told you about? The dead yeah. one? so we got a call from the police today. Um, apparently he has gone missing. Yeah. Um, I guess he actually was a bit crazy. Uh, I, I remember oh, it like geez. the day before his last night of the week, uh, he asked me to be with him on his shift that night. Oh, oh god, oh god! He told me there was something he had to show me. I know, it sounds crazy, right? No! And then we checked the surveillance equipment. We found out that he had brought a wrench and completely smashed blank. Um, he had also left the building in the middle of his shift after that. I mean, he must have, you know, he was nowhere to be found the next morning. <laughs> Couldn't contact him or anything. <laughs> so. He ran away. He ran away and dove headfirst into one of these suits. Probably all the way over to Freddy Fazbear's to find another job. Where's, where's Mr. Wanda? Ah, oh God, oh God, oh God, oh God. Oh, oh, Momo was right outside my door. I would have had no idea. I don't know what the penguin does. Oh, hi. How's it going, Jojo? Jojo and Momo. Got the left side on lockdown, but so do I. Man, Momo was quick. Like Momo jumped like three rooms. It's only night four, too. Man, they were there. Oh, God, there he is. Yeah, they went in an all out sprint, like right off the bat. What do you do? I don't know what you do. Man, I swear, those first two hours were way too much for me. Uh, but at least it's all calmed down. So I, at least I can. Oh, God. At least I can tell you guys a story now. So, what do you want to hear? Stories of my childhood? Man, I used to go back into the creek with my brother. We never went to a Chuck E. Cheese's, that's for sure. I'm pretty sure that the only animatronic experience that I had is at this place called Jungle Gyms. And I don't know how many people out there- Ah-ha! Ah, I get it! Oh, God. I don't know how many of you out there even know what Jungle Gyms is, but... It's this grocery store type of thing, but even calling it a grocery store isn't, like, enough to describe it. 
It's a hey! Oh man, it's beyond a grocery store. It's it's huge. It has an international market. They also have animatronics, oddly enough. And I remember every single time I went in jungle gyms, it was terrifying. And they were huge. Like they were way bigger than like your average person so I can like I can see how that would be terrifying and you can imagine me as a kid it's even bigger than that like there was a lion I think there was a gorilla and they were all singing and dancing and I don't know what it is about anim animatronics and singing and dancing they don't they don't need to sing and dance they don't need that it's not it's not important for everybody yay okay man I didn't I was racking my brain trying to talk about jungle gyms, trying to actually concentrate on the game here, and it was not working out for me. Oh. Oh! Hi, Candy and Cindy. Are you about to go into the meat grinding machine? Why are you pointing at him? What did they do? What have you done to anger the baby? You should be ashamed of yourself. Oh, God. Oh, no. Hi! Hi! How you doing? I thought he was angry at you! There is an easter egg that someone told me about that I need to find out about. It's very personal to me and me alone. You have two new messages. You've probably noticed uh, that there is an extra door in the second party room, uh, which is on um, camera 9, I think. <clears throat> uh, it's, it's not on the map. That's because it's it's really nothing special. It's it's like a storage room. Uh, we don't go in there much. Like I I haven't even been in there myself. You know. Uh, I just wanted to inform you that you don't need to worry about it, and that it's not a mistake. That it's not on the map or anything like that. Oh, okay. So apparently that did an Easter egg. My face came up at the screen and said, I was the king of... <laughs> well, it seems to be rather, you know, chill for night five, unless they have another surprise up the... Oh, okay. Unless they have another surprise up their sleeve for me. Oh, there's Momo. Okay, so Momo's coming up. Any second now. Oh, God, he's right there! Oh, oh okay, there he is. Yeah, what do you know? I predict the future, eh? Ah! Oh, God! I don't even- that didn't even register! Oh, man! Ah! Ah! Fuck you! Oh, I don't like this. Oh no. Oh, hey, how's it going there? Well, that was tough. God damn. So this was the Easter egg, just so it's clear. I'm the king of Five Freddy! That's me. <laughs> Apparently I'm in the game. That's cool. Someone told me that about that in the co comments, so thank you guys for letting me know about that. I don't like that. Oh, hi, Momo. What is that? Why is it? Hey, why is any of that? Hello. Double teaming me, huh? Well, good thing I'm an expert at handling that kind of action. Back in my day in old Five Nights at Freddy's, I used to get double, triple, even quadruple teamed at all times. It was not fun. Oh, I heard him! Ho ho ho! Oh! God damn it. You know what? I'm just gonna ride this out! Cause I'm pretty sure that I'm gonna be okay! I'm almost gone. I'm not gonna be a baby about the- Hey! I was about to say, like, Oh! Oh no! Am I dead? Ah! Yeah! Oh. Hi, Blank! I can do- Hey, whoa, hey, whoa, hey, whoa, hey, whoa! Whoa! I can't move on this. Hi. Oh, a mistake. Oh, a mistake. You talking about me? My mistake. Oh, oh, it's all right then. Just carry on then. A problem. <laughs> oh, oh, 
You're a problem. Oh, okay. Well, you know, it's your mistake, though, so I, I think we gotta agree on something here that... Ugh. Good God. Hey! Mary Schmidt! I didn't know that I was playing a female. What is... Whoa, what is that? Whoa, no, 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 wait a minute here. Wait a minute. That is not an animatronic that was in the game. You have one new message. Uh-huh. Uh, hello? Hey. You, um, do know that you don't have to be here today, right? Mm-hmm. Well, I guess you're just very committed to the job then. Uh, but anyway, uh, you've done a great job this week. So now please take a break tomorrow, okay? Hey. Now, see you next week. Good night. Wait, that's all you're gonna say about me? You told me about a secret room before! Oh god. You're being a little too active for my taste, thank you very much. I have other- ah! What was that?! What was that?! What the hell?! That was a mouse! Why was there a mouse?! I might have missed a memo here, but I thought this was Five Nights at Candy's! Candy being a kitty cat. Oh God, there, there, there. I see you, what the hell? What is with that? That's a bunch of baloney. Where are you there? Where did you come from? What are you? Oh God, ah, no, oh God, no, oh God. This night is going to be a bitch. I mean, sassafras. <laughs> Why do I gotta be working alone in this place? You'd think that they could hire another shift or something. Because I mean, goddamn, being alone here kind of sucks. I mean, I don't, I'm not one to complain about the job market being bad and all that, and I understand that I should be grateful that I have a job at all. But I mean, come on, mousy mm, wowsy. I'm not one to complain about the economy, but frankly, this kind of sucks, balls. I mean, a lot of balls. I mean, like 23 different sets of balls going on at once. And I mean. I'm not saying, like, I'm an expert in that or anything. I don't know exactly what I'm talking about, but I mean, if I had to quantify it in a certain way, it would probably be quantifiable in a number of sets of balls in someone's mouth. Not mine. I should shut up. I shouldn't have been so spastic about keeping everything closed, but I was just a little paranoid. What was that? Oh, hey, it's the Radicus. Okay, so the Radicus is on the way. Cindy. Is that you, baby? Cindy, I told you, never call me again. We're over. We're through. What we had was just very brief. One of our nine lives. I've got other lives to live. I gotta explore the world, you know? Hey, yeah! I did it! Oh, yeah! Yeah! Oh, man, that was hard. It's the whole family, even Radicus. Radicus, Momo, Blank, all one big happy O. Oh, oh look, they're singing a song. Kumbaya. Uh, not okay. Oh, that's why they were in that position. They weren't just tired. How's it going, buddy? Boy, Eradicus sure is a nice guy. Glad he stopped by. Yay! Mary Schmidt. I did it. I got some overtime. That was pretty tough, but I did manage to do it because I used too much power in the beginning of there. I had to be very sparing towards the end, but I had a system down. So if Night 7 doesn't introduce a rogue element that is even worse and pump up everyone else to horrifying levels, I should be fine, right? Ha 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 ha! Probably. Okay, so that's two star- Oh, custom night. Extra. Let me see. What is this? Oh, okay. Cool. Candy? Cindy? Chester? I didn't- Pangu? Blank? Momo? Rat. Why does it? Oh God! Seven twenty mode. I don't think I'm going to succeed at that. Let me just give you a little taste of what this is gonna be like, because I imagine it's gonna be bad. Uh oh, oh no! Ah, God damn it! Get me! Ah! Hey! Okay. So that was. 
was 720 mode, which I had been, if I had been paying a bit more attention, if I had been paying a bit more attention, I might have been doing okay on that. Now this game was released hours ago. Just hours ago, and oddly enough, not too soon after I finished Five Nights at Candy's 1. So this is one of the few Five Nights at Freddy's uh, fan games that I'm going to play. Hey, how's it going? Lol, you lost the bet. Well, I've lost many bets and many unfortunate things have happened to me. What are you referring to? You know what that means. Nope, not really. If you could be a little more informative. You uh, have to spend five nights in that old factory again. Again? What kind of bet would I make that that would be done? Or else people will think you're a chicken. Scared? Uh, type up a reply. You bet, ass bag. I ain't going back there by the hair. Oh, by the ha. You bet. Lamau. What was so funny, but no, don't fade to black. Oh boy. You're surrounded by darkness. Press space to use the camera flash from your cell phone. Use this to briefly be able to s see down the dark hallway. Flick the mouse downwards to turn on the camera panel. This doesn't seem good. I've got the equivalent of a camera flash. Oh no, that's not good. Click on the camera icons to view the cameras. You can call any of the internal phones in the building through the camera panel. Any phone you call will make a ringing noise, which will echo throughout the central hall. The animatronics can only hear the phones if they are in the same room as the phone, or if they are in the central hallway. Use the phones to learn the animatronic out of the central hall before they get you! But be careful! If they reach the room with the ringing phone, they're trying to temporarily disable the phone! Oh man. This is gonna be a bitch. Oh hi. Whoa, hey there. How you doing? Now you get to be annoyed by- uh oh. Well, that ain't good. Oh, hello. <laughs> That's number one. Oh, does that mean- <gasps> How am I supposed to survive this? How am I supposed to survive five nights? Or seven nights, as it's more likely gonna be. Hot tits. That is a good system, by the way. That is a really good system. That is a terrifying system, but that's actually pretty good. Oh man, that is, oh, that is fantastic. And this is the first night! What's gonna be like when there's six different animatronics coming at me from all angles, including behind? I'm more concerned about the behind one. Why did I agree to this bet? And why would I come back? If I've experienced this before, it said you're gonna have to stay at the abandoned factory again. Or else people are gonna think I'm a chicken. What kind of ass bag excuse is that? You know, I, I do ponder why there's a system of phones set up like this. Logically speaking, it's not 100%. Oh God, that was too much. Why'd you do that? Why not just let me enjoy my celebration with happy children cheering for me? Oh, what is that? Oh no! It's the first game. Hello, is there a Radicus in there? Hello. Oh, hey, that looked like a puppet. I'm not 100% sure on that one, but that was pretty much a puppet. We're in 1989, the year I was born. Should I be concerned about all this? The answer is definitely yes. Oh, hey, hi, Blank. Hi, Blanky Blue. Okay, goodbye. Okay, so I got the key, so it should be a. <laughs> Hi, okay. All right, then. That was good. Rolling right along. Night two. Let's see what you got in store for me. If I'm gonna die, which is probably more likely than the alternative of me surviving and actually being good at a game. One of the animatronics will attempt to climb into the ventilation systems to get you. If you hear noises coming from the vents, find the camera the animatronic is on, and then call the phone in the room to scare it away from the vent. What? What a load of ass. Where? I don't know where that is. Oh, oh, oh! I don't know where that is! Oh, hi! Oh, God! Ah! Uh, ah! Uh. Oh, no. I don't know what that was! I didn't know what that was! I thought I was dead like a hundred ways! I thought I was dead! So when one phone is ringing, I can't do anything until that phone is done, so she should just roll- yeah, she should just roll straight through. So if I hit it from all the way on the opposite end, 
then that should just lead her from one end to the other. Oh, hi. Oh, hi. I can't. Ah. Hi. Oh, okay. That was a blur. Where? 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 There you are. Oh, fuck. Oh. Hi. How are you? Missing girl. 17-year-old Marilyn Schmidt did not show up for school yesterday after she allegedly been staying overnight with her friend in this week. Marilyn's friend later revealed that Marilyn was spending the night in an abandoned factory on St. Antonia's Road and that they had lied to Marilyn's parents. Marilyn had lost a bet with some of her classmates where she had to spend five nights in a factory. Apparently again, because she's done it before. I don't know why. Now this video is a little late and I'm sorry for that. Unfortunately, Chica, my puppy, was playing in the mud in the front yard after it rained last night. And uh, it was an interesting little story arc. I've got some pictures. It went from, she was so excited that she got to play in the mud. And, oh boy, I can't wait to tell you all about it, dad. To immediately when I had to take her inside and put a swim cap on. Oh, oh, what did I do? I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to make you mad. To then going once we got in the shower. Oh, it's just a bath. Oh, it's okay. Thanks so much. This is great. I love my life. So that was my adventure with Chica this morning. And now I get to play with other animals that want to put harm on me in some way. One of the reasons that I get so easily irked in Five Nights at Freddy's is because I have this latent fear of... I have this fear of animatronics. I forget what the actual scientific term is, but so whenever I go into a store and I see like store mannequins, it just makes my skin crawl. Like the same thing with like the reaction to tryptophobia. I think I've said that before, but just for clarity's sake, I don't like animatronics. What is that? That sketch, the middle one on the left side. I haven't seen that animatronic before, so I don't know what that is. It's weird. Oh, why is that gotta be scary? Why do you gotta make that scary? That's not cool, bruh. Not cool. Return. Return what to where? Do I gotta return something to that box, or do I gotta return the horrible monstra- That's a monkey arm on the ground. One of three. Oh! Oh, this is my job! Oh, my job is to pick up the dismembered body parts of all that have been deadified in here. This is polish right here. This is well crafted. Uh, okay, I'll come get you in a second there, buddy. But this is well crafted. It's well made. It's well designed. It's, 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 it's cool. Oh, boy. Oh. We did it! I was on the uh, the Game Grumps charity stream just yesterday and it went really, really well. It went amazingly well. Thank you to everyone who donated, but... Oh god, what's gonna happen now? Hi! Oh, I don't know what that is! Oh! Oh! Oh, that's not good! Oh god! Sass surveillance! Get your sass out of your ass! We need to- Oh god, that was the wrong one! You! Oh shit, shut that one up, get on the- Oh god, I didn't know that that was the thing that was gonna happen. Oh, this got much harder and immediately. I think the effective strategy is just to keep them bouncing around different places so that you don't- you don't stay- stay in one place for too long and then they, they stay mobile. Sorry, I'm getting a little antsy. Honk for luck! Yay! It's not even a honk anymore, it's more of a squeaky squonk. We're okay, everything is fine, even though everything is obviously not fine. I'm gonna- I'm gonna try this in my ass! In my asshole! Look at me, it's that wild hole! So bang bong over there and then I'm a ding dong the phone off and then you're gonna go fuck yourself! Okay, we got it. Game face on. Shit. God damn it, get out of here, Cindy Candy. I don't even know what your name is anymore. Yeah, you, you better disappear at the last second. My heart is like racing a million miles an hour. I'm not capable of handling stressful situations like this. Even though it's just a stupid video game. I'm not okay. I'm going so crazy. I think I'm hearing phones ringing when they're not ringing. That it's ringing there. I know this. Fuck you. Oh. Oh, there we go. Uh, got it. Nailed it. All right. Now let's get through this animatronic nightmare and we'll be on our way to night four. Where I imagine things are only going to get better for me. Except they're not. I know that for a fact. Oh, no, I'm blank. Why am I blank? Wait a minute, 1991, it was it was 1989 before. Is this two years later? Wait a minute, hang on, I gotta go back and look at the dates there because that calendar definitely changed. Our band 
Who's on the left? Oh. Oh, okay. I thought he was gonna come at me. As far as I know, I've been told that there are a total of nine animatronics, including one super secret, super duper ultra animatronic. This is a bit too much for me. This is a bit too much. God damn it, you're not in the right spot. Stop! There's only three animatronics out right now, as far as I know. Oh, hello. Ah, f four, four! Forgot about sassy bitch. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Okay, we're fine. Everything's fine. I still don't know what's gonna happen if JoJo actually gets into the vents. Actually, I know exactly what's gonna happen. It's gonna murder my face! That's the one. Okay. Man, it is just a blind. There we go. Hey. All right. Wow. Damn. Hot tits. Holy balls. Oh, return. Return what? Return both of us? Am I supposed to hold your hand on this one? Oh, what is that? Is that a tie? Oh, did Candy have a tie? But I would have assumed that it was a bow tie, but maybe not. Would you like your tie back? Oh. Well, that seemed like a fruitless task. Why was that my job? It would be a good idea to come to haunted uh, old abandoned warehouse in middle of night and stay here five days. Uh, what do I do about you? I don't know what I do about you. Uh, I don't know what I do about you. Oh, that's not good. Oh, that's not. Hey, how's it going? Are you doing, friend? Oh God, he's gonna get in. Oh God, that doesn't sound good. What do I do about that? Oh, what do I do about that? Oh, what do I do about that? Oh, what do I do about you? <laughs> Jesus. I don't know what to do about that one. That's new and interesting. Maybe I'm not supposed to look at him, because looking is death. What, do I gotta follow you? You freak? You freak? You big tall... What, did you pull it out? What, did you do that? Did you- You did that! You don't like the phone! Oh, hi. What? Wait, why are you back there? Shit. God, why are you back here? Oh god, oh god, oh god! <laughs> oh, what? I- What? The game broke! Ah! Found a bug! Okay, we're back! Let's get back into the game because that was not a good try anyway. Oh, hi. How's it going there? God, you are so handsome. I don't think he's attracted by the sound. I think he just kind of skipped it over. Maybe he just doesn't like to be looked at. I don't like... Oh, God, why? Hello? What? What? Do you just choose randomly? Oh, shit. What? What? The, the fuck? <laughs> Can you... Hi. Are you just following me? Are you following... God damn it. Are you... F you are. Me thinks you, maybe you are. You are a bitch, and I don't like you, and I would wish that you don't do- Hello, goodbye. So, either he goes where I'm looking, and he kind of follows my gaze. Hello, hello, hello. Okay, pile up on here. Which is good, because that means that I, I just need to be looking that- Okay, if my theory is correct, if I stay- Well, let me do this. If I stay looking down this hallway, eventually he's- gonna show up maybe 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 not okay my theory is very wrong Ooh, look at that angle that's not your good angle not that you have a good angle but everything about that face just reminds me that I want to throw up I mean you look at someone and you're kind of like "Ooh, that's a face only a mother could love that mother threw him to the curb as soon as she took one gander at how horribly horrendously ugly it was and I say it because it's obviously not a person because a person could not be that ugly are we clear blank you're fucking ugly you're fugly as fuck. That's not a good thing. That's not the right place. This is not the- f Oh, fuck, I'm dead. Why? Why have you done this to me? Oh! I sh I got too caught up in insulting him that I kind of forgot that I needed to play the game. I was so- I was having so much fun there. Shit. Why is no one going for that? Hello? Oh God, please go away. Not you, not what I wanted. Why are you hanging out there? Stop that! 
Oh God, that's not what I wanted. That's not what I wanted. Please don't be behind the screen. Okay. I just like to keep people in room one because it, it, it does, serves double function to keep him here. And so long as I don't let him rip the phone out of the wall, everything is gonna be fine. This place was nice before you started ripping things out of the wall, you fuck ugly bastard. Stop that. Stop. Oh, oh, oh fuck. Oh. Oh, damn it. Why? Why would you make that a jump scare? I don't appreciate it. It's not something that's good for me. Okay, we made it through that and we're doing okay. So long as we find out what the hell this is all about. What am I searching for? Hello? Who the hell are you? Who the, who the hell do you think you are? Security guard. Oh, hi. Are the police here? Uh, oh, I, it took me a, a second to register that those are flashing police lights, red and blue. Oh, no. Oh, this is, oh man. I had chills running down my spine. Oh no. Oh, that's not good. Oh, fuck you. Hey, fuck you! I didn't do anything! What, what the hell? That guy was really happy to be tasing me, an animatronic! That guy had a big old smile on his face. Old factory set for demolition. The abandoned factory on St. Antonia's Road 27 has been scheduled for demolition sometime next week. The now 45 year old factory closed in 1993 after it was deemed unsafe due to yet another fatal incident inside the factory. Yeah, yet another death. The factory used to belong to Robotics Corp, a company that went bankrupt shortly after the factory closed. The company was specialized in the design and production of robotic animatronics. They started in 1962 where they made mechanical wire controlled animatronics, and over the years their animatronics got more advanced. A total of six casualties occurred in the factory over the past 45 years. The most remarkable one being in 1987 when a pair of twins went missing and were later discovered to have been killed in one of the assembly machines in the factory. Best selling author sellout. Well, that's an interesting follow up headline. A uh, blood red night six, just like my hair. Let's find out what's going on here. I don't think I'm gonna win right off the bat, but I'm gonna do my best. Okay, what do we got? Who, oh, I don't know how to deal with you. Oh, that ain't good. Hi, oh, what are you? Oh, what are you? What are you? Oh, oh I, just, I had no time. My sass got blasted. That guy's coming down the hall. Whoa, 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 whoa. What do I do? I don't know what to do. Okay. <laughs> well, I am confuzzled. Hello. Oh, you're both here. Good. Why are you both here? Oh God, where are you? Hi, what are you both doing here? Why? Why? It's Radicus and then Catechus, I think. Radicus and Catechus are trying to, trying to fuck. Oh God. Oh man. Those, not the friendliest bunches that I've ever seen. Okay, so it's, it's, it's generally the same rules as before. Generally. Just, I have no time if I see the face. I gotta like flip it down. Whoa, hello, goodbye. Oh God, I am legitimately, ah oh, fuck, I wasn't quick. I wasn't ready. I was gonna flip to another one. Oh God, oh God, oh God. It's doing the thing, it's doing the thing, doing the thing. Hello, goodbye. Oh, fuck me. Oh God, oh God, he went away. Oh God, he went away. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Now that I got this situation handled, I think this is actually gonna be okay. Which one, which one? Is it the same one? Oh, it's the same one. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, 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 honk! Ah, yeah! Oh man, once I had that on lockdown, it was pretty simple. It was okay. Let's find out what the final mystery here is. <sighs> Who is that? Is that Momo? Oh, no, no. Momo no likey! Hi. Hi. Yeah, I'll follow you. Oh, hi. Right. Gray guy. <laughs> Oh, 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 God. What? Oh, okay. <laughs> He's just gonna tase me and I'm gonna fall over. Oh, I'm still playing. Oh no, this is 1976 now. This is a completely different time period. 1976, why are these like, were these like all the incidents that people got killed throughout this thing? Oh, look. Oh, hi, shadow cat. You gonna, oh hi, how's it going there? You think you scare blank? Blank is a, an impassive, ugly fuck. He has to look at him. 
Blank has to look at himself in the mirror, but okay. Oh, a crying child. Oh no. Uh oh. Hi. Hooray. Uh oh. Goodbye. Now, this is 1987. Alrighty then. Here we go. Oh. Uh huh. Oh. Oh, okay. Well then, I think I straight up murdered that guy. Factory burned to the ground? The old abandoned robotics factory that was scheduled for demolition had caught fire this morning. The exact cause of the fire is unknown, but experts were able to deduct that the fire originated this from somewhere within the warehouse department of the factory. It was also discovered that the factory's power schedule had not been discontinued when the factory closed, so the cause was most likely either faulty wiring or overloaded heating equipment. The local fire brigade arrived at the factory around 7 a.m., where already most of the building was engulfed in flames. Around 8 a.m., the building then finally collapsed, leaving nothing but rubble. The worst. Something's the worst down there. I think worst movie. Okay, so that might be the end of the story, but there's extra materials here, and we might have... Oh! Well, this is happy-go-lucky. Oh, there's Pangu. Man, I didn't even see Pangu in the game. Was he anywhere in there? I don't remember him being there. The rat. Hi. The cat. Raticus and Catechus. I was I was more correct than I knew. Seven of twenty. Oh no, I don't want to do seven twenty mode. There's a normal and a question mark. I don't want to do those. I don't think I have the patience to do those, but maybe I'll give them a try in another episode I'll explore around. I've been very lax about doing the 2020 modes on uh, these fan-made games, mostly because I want to keep my sanity intact. I've played both Five Nights at Candy's 1 and 2, so I'm kind of excited to be able to play this one because it has not been a disappointment. It's been a pretty good one, but again, this is just a demo. Look around with a mouse. You can look to the sides and also up and down. Look down and two buttons will appear. The blue button turns you to the tape player. The red button lets you look underneath the bed. Ah, uh, okay. If the monster attacks, hold the flashlight in the monster's eyes until it goes away. If the monster goes into your bed, find out which side of bed is hiding under. Then while not looking under the bed, look in the other direction of the bedroom to lure the monster to peek out from under the bed. When you're peeking out, turn to the other side of the bed. I don't know what the hell you're talking about. Playing the music tape in the tape player makes the night go much faster. It is possible to survive the night without using the I don't know. I'm not gonna- Oh, God. Oh, I'm not gonna win this. Oh, I'm not gonna win this. Oh, I'm not gonna win this. Oh, oh, oh God. Oh no, the room is so big. Oh God, no. Eh, eh. La 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 la. <laughs> oh my God. Is he here? Oh fuck God. Hey, 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 hey. I saw that. I noticed the tape player fucking stop. I don't know what you are yet. Calm down! I might be in a spot of bother. Oh shit. Oh shit. Ugh. Why? Hello? I th I saw something, but I still haven't seen you! Hi! Hey! Oh, hi! Whoa! Okay! Yeah, look into the flashlight! Does that bother you? Are you bothered by that? I think I remember you. Whoa! Ah, uh, that's not good. Oh! Am I dead? I might be dead. Oh, hi, hello, hi, okay, all right, okay, all right, I don't know what that was all about. Okay, bye, okay, all right, cool, great, good, good having you visit. Always love when company comes over. Okay, where you at, buddy boo? Where, where you at? Where you at, buddy boo? Oh, <laughs> fucking God damn it! I don't know how to beat you. Thank you. That's very difficult. Okay, so, I don't know how to beat that, but I'll try again. Oh, oh, it's me. It's me. Oh, I did not notice that. Oh, that's so cool. I'm in the game. I have red hair. I don't have that anymore. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, fucking, fucking. Hey, fucking goddammit. Why are you there? Don't do that. Here we go. Wait, okay. All right, you're on that side. So I got to look over here. Then look back. Oh, quickly, quickly, quickly. Okay, that's not good. Okay. Yeah, la di da di da di da. Looking over there. Oh, fucking fuck! 
All right, so that's fucking impossible. I don't know what they mean by a lot faster, but the night is definitely not going a lot faster with the music. Oh shit. Hey, fucking no, 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 no. Stop, 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 stop. No, 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 I'm gonna beat you. Ah, uh, you think you beat me? Huh? No. That's just very no. Fuck. Okay. So he's under the bed. So I just gotta peek under, see what side. Peek. Boy, I think he's on the right, I guess. Oh, fuck, I didn't see. Looking back. Looking away. Looking back. <laughs> fucking what? I fucking did it! I did the thing it said! God damn it! Alright, one more try. Find out which side of the bed he's hiding under, then while not looking under the bed, look in the direct other direction of the bedroom to lure him to peek out. When you hear it peeking out, turn to the other side of the bedroom, then strike with your flashlight. Oh, okay, I guess. Gonna play my tape, gonna play my fun tape. It's a fun tape full of fun times. It's also got some fuck yous in there. It's my fun fuck tape. Ah, that's bad for a, I don't have a fun fuck tape. That's, that's just bad. I better, a band, I'm bailing out of this joke. I'm bailing, nope, back flipping out of this joke. This is not a good joke. Whoa, hello. Okay, I fucking stop. What? Come on! Okay, fine. Alright, where are you at? Whoa, okay, you're on that side, huh? So I'm just gonna... Oh... Ha ha ha! Got ya! Ha ha ha! Okay, alright. I get it. I get it now. There you are. Yeah, go fuck yourself! Go fuck yourself! Go fuck yourself! Oh, where are you going? Well, I see you. I saw that! Trying to hide in my closet. Get out of there, R. Kelly rat. Stands for rat, Kelly. That's a bad joke again. God damn it! I need to stop doing that! It's a high stress situation! I can't make good jokes! So I kind of got the strategy down. As soon as you hear the steps, you gotta go to one extreme, whatever extreme you're closest to. And then you gotta hit that and immediately go back and he'll be in the other one. Whoa, what the fuck was that? Don't do surprises! I am just explaining the stratagems here. Gotcha. <laughs> Goodbye, fricko. <laughs> Fucking what? Hi. Okay, thanks for announcing it. Oosh. I mean, you're not. Re Yay! I did it! That was as hard as 20 mode! Ha, ah, no, it was not, but okay, it was still pretty good. It's actually good to see this because it's been a long time since I played Five Nights at Candy's 1 or 2. I played them at the beginning of last year, so this is the beginning of this year now, so it's kind of nice to see it come around. And with an interesting mechanic, I mean, having the double wide room is kind of disconcerting, and I like that, but there's some cool stuff that could be done with this. I just think there might need to be a few more characters. I'm hoping they're gonna be, or maybe it's gonna be a Spring's Trap style thing, but we'll see what happens when the full game gets released. Whoa, hang on a second. I see those buttons! Hey, if you look behind, I'm gonna brighten this in post, but I think I see something. There's buttons there. I see that, and I see you! I remember what you did. They remember too. You were the reason that we were all there. It happened because of you. And you can't tell anyone. Why would you? It is your fault. Hi, okay, all right then. All of it. It's been two weeks. I understand that it was a very traumatic experience, but luckily, your brother wasn't seriously hurt. You have to remember, they weren't real. They were just machines. They aren't capable of harming anyone. What happened was just an accident. He was just... broken. Or my brother or the machine? Have you still had nightmares since we last met? Were they about those monsters you drew for me? Ugh. You're a very creative girl. Thank you. But you can't let your fears take control of your imagination. In order for your nightmares to end, you have to face your fears. I don't know if I want to do that. You have to face the monsters. Again, don't think that's a good idea. Show them that you're not afraid. How do I do that when I'm peeing my pants in front of them? Do you understand? No, not at all. It's the only way. But now, Mary, 
I need you to try and remember what happened on that day a year ago. Okay, I'll try real hard, whoever you are. I don't know who I'm talking to, but... Oh... I'm the origami cat. How am I here? You're dreaming right now. Mm, sort of, at least. This is the deepscape. This is where your deepest memories are. I'm talking to you from the dreamscape. See those glowing particle thingies? They make up a path. The tape player should be somewhere ahead. Just remember to stay on the path so the shadows can't get you. If you get lost, I can get you back only if you're on the path. You mean this darkness? Mm. Okay. Well, that didn't work out for me. I was just wanted to test the theory of the darkness. This is a lot different than I expected it to be, and I like it. Whoa, hey, slow down there. It's you, my old friend. I thought that you had forgotten about me. It's been kind of boring in here. There isn't much room for racing around in the toy box. I remember back when we used to have a race every day. That was lots of fun. We should totally do that again sometime. Oh well, I bet you didn't come all the way over here down for me. You should get what you came for and then hurry back to safety. If you have anything to say, say it now. I don't know. If you have anything to say, say it now. I, I got nothing to say to you. You stay down in that toy box where I put you. You don't talk to me. You didn't win me no races. Oh, I feel bad now. I really like this, though. It was, uh, like, I just expected it to be, like, the demo over and over again. But this is, this is, like, original and interesting. Hello. Ooh. Is this it? Found arcade game number one. Found the tape player. Good. Now I can hurry back, I think, I suppose. And hopefully death will not wait for me when I'm coming home. I do appreciate the backstory. Like, it's interesting to know that there's something to this character, and something that tied together all the other games. Because, to be perfectly frank, I don't remember a lot of story out of the other games. All I remember is that they were a pretty good Five Nights at Freddy's clone. But this is more. It's trying to be more, and that's what I can appreciate. Alright, let's snooze it up! We got my race car, though. Oh. Here we go, then. I, if I remember the demo correctly, this is going to be a time. Oh, I'm ready. It's me! Oh, back when I had red hair and a pink mustache. Oh, hey! Were those always there? Hello! Hi, Sam, how you doing? Boop, your nose, your nose, your nose. Uh, I don't like that. Hey! Where'd you come from, huh? Oh, yeah, you think you're gonna get away from me this time? I've, I've learned a thing or two about where your face is and how to shine on it. Call me the Shining because I'm about to. Oh, fuck, something crawled out of the bed. <laughs> that ain't good. Let me just see what. Hi, okay, alright then, let's just. Okay, I remember how to do this. And it seems like it's gone for now. And it seems like this is going to be. Just as painful as it was before. Is this like current time? Am I talking to that therapist person now, or am I uh, just kind of reliving some horrible memories of me having too many closets? Oh god, is this symbolic or something? I don't want to know! God, when do these kids get any sleep? Do they ever sleep? I mean, with Five Nights at Freddy's 4, it was an acceptable medium that maybe it was all a lie and you were in a hospital because your frontal lobe had been bitten off. And you were only stuck in a perpetual world of nightmares until you would hope to either wake up or die. That was legitimately the story of Five Nights at Freddy's 4. Did you guys know that? That is, that is quite literally the story. There's a lot of clues spread around in Five Nights at Freddy's 4. He's really douchey. And if this is the first night, then what the hell is in store for me later? The therapist talking about how the kid shouldn't let her fears conquer her imagination. Are these things real? Are they really here stalking a little girl in her bedroom at night? And maybe in her paranoia and lack of sleep, she just doesn't know how to handle the monsters. Oh, fuck, I forgot the monsters that keep her awake at night. A pretty typical nightmare. I was being chased by someone with a chainsaw. I must have been like seven or eight at the time, maybe nine. But, I was being chased by someone with a chainsaw, and, uh, it was, uh, 
It was really freaky because for some reason I was running, but I could see his face very clearly. Like, just this huge, angry face just burned into my mind. And then I woke up. But the terrifying, the terrifying thing was, I could still see that face. That face was literally burned into my eyes. When I looked in my doorway, in front of my bed, at the foot of my bed, I saw his face. Nothing else, not his body, not the chainsaw, just his face staring at me from the doorway. It was the most chilling experience. I threw my head under the covers, like, I, I hid, I thought I was gonna die, I, I cowered in fear. And again, I'm a child, but when you're a child and you see something horrible like that, just a figment of your own imagination come to terrorize you. I think that it's real. Yay, we did it! We beat the first night! Oh, good. Hello. Oh, where are we now? Hi, sweetie. Are you having fun? I hope you're happy with the place I picked out. It's just the two of us while your brother is at camp. So you can decide what we should have for dinner tonight. Hey, you kid. I'm the rat. Nice to meet you. Say, I see what's about to start in a few minutes. Wanna play hide and seek? Oh, yeah, I do. Neo! You're high and I'll stay here. I can't feel hungry. Backstage employees only, okay. Alright, I'm gonna play hide and seek with the rat. That's good. Hide under the table? Sure. Okay. Oh! Okay. <laughs> I found you! Alrighty then. Thank you. That was a good game! Like the other Five Nights at Candy's games, I'm gonna do a full playthrough of this. And I'm actually very eager about this one because it does put a lot more emphasis on the backstory and give the world some fleshed out nature. Because that's a lot of things that these Five Nights at Freddy's fan games missed, was giving themselves a universe. And they kind of did it, you know, in a half-assed, oh, that's in the title, it's just what it is way. But this is creating something. And I like it, and it's good. So how did it go? Oh, wonderfully. You managed to beat them. Awesome job. Wait, was it only the monster rat? I thought there'd be more. Phew. But don't celebrate yet. Those monsters are very persistent. He will probably come back even stronger. But don't be scared. Remember the strategy from last night. Then everything should be fine. You already have your stuff, so... If you want to, you can skip the deepscape and go to sleep right away. There's still stuff out there to be discovered. If you feel like playing detective, that is. Continue north to reach the path. Ugh. Ah! Okay! All right! Mm -hmm. Oh, hey! I didn't make it! Who'd have thunk you did? Ah! Okay, I saw something. Did you guys see that? The black shadow? North towards the path, halfway through the darkness, turn east. Oh! Ah, good. Incomplete instructions, eh? That's not east, that's west! Ah! Okay, found something even though I went the wrong way. A part of a newspaper article. Read it. Sure. Experience the show like never before with puppeteering technology of the future. The rat and cat will take you on a new adventures to brand new and exciting worlds of fun. Ready then, thank you. Where am I supposed to go now? Oh, okay. Alright, this time I gotta turn east. Ah! Oh, fuck, I didn't go far enough. Ah, God damn it! Alrighty then. Yeah. Uh, oh, I saw it! Oh, I saw it! I almost had that! Boop! Oh! I made it! Holy shit, I made it! Okay, so it was possible. Holy shit. Hello, what are you? What is this? Oh, found arcade game number two. Well, good for me! What else is here? Nothing. Alrighty then. Anything else? Ha! Oh, okay, all right then. But I found the arcade game. Let's go to sleep. Bye-bye, everybody. The second night. So hopefully, or unhopefully, there's more monsters waiting for me in the darkness. So I gotta be even more attentive than I was last time. So does that mean that the cat is gonna be present now? Because if it is, I don't know if it's going to be any different. The, the cat in my dream suggested that it might actually be the same. But I'll still be ready to punch him up his rectum 
if he even comes remotely close to me. I've got a lot more nightmare stories, but by the way, in case you guys actually wanted to hear all that. Like, when I say I have nightmares all the time, I am not joking. I have nightmares almost every other night. A lot of the times I'll have what are called waking nightmares, where you wake up, but you don't know you're awake, you're still dreaming, so you kind of hallucinate things in your room, and you hallucinate seeing things, like in the shadows, and and, and, and you're, you're literally trapped there. You, you can't move because your body is still frozen, and so your mind is like halfway between dreaming and reality, and, and that happens to me quite a lot, actually. I think I was like 14, maybe? Um, I was... I was in bed, and I don't remember having a nightmare that night, but I remember waking up in the middle of the night. I woke up for no apparent reason, and when I looked up at the ceiling, it was crawling. Like, the ceiling was moving. I had one of those textured ceilings, you know, the, the stucco patterns, whatever it is. So I, I think it was just my eyes playing tricks on me, but for some reason, and, and I, I don't really know why, I got out of bed. Um, I got out of bed and grabbed my notebook. I sat down at the base of the stairs in the darkness, and I just stared at the doorway next to it, the hallway, entryway, archway, and I, I just stared there and I sat there and I couldn't tell if I was dreaming or not. I really couldn't tell, like, what I was doing or what was going on. I, I just remember I was staring at this doorway, just watching it morph and shift and, and, like, change. And I would blink and I would think that something was there. Like, there's this shadow looming in the hallway, like, entryway. Whoa, okay, you're whispering to me. I don't like that. Fuck, God damn it! ow. I don't know what was with that noise, but it covered up any possibility of me hearing him creak out. And I was almost done! I was almost done there! Ow, I wailed my hand on my mic stand. Whoa, I got him to go away! Holy shit, I've never done that before! I, I take my notebook and I just start sketching the doorway, like, the whole entryway, and I sketch. Uh, just trying to get, like, a picture of what I saw. I'm not 100% sure why. Um, but I was just sitting at the bottom of the stairwell in the darkness. It was like 3 a.m., sketching. And then, I can't even see what I'm drawing because it's so dark. So, I just kind of get a rough outline. And then, I look closely at what I was drawing. And I see what I drew. And I, I literally just drew this shadowy figure standing in the doorway. And for some reason, when I did that, it made it really real for me. Like, maybe I was still dreaming at that point, but I was physically downstairs. And so, like, I sort of realized where I was and looked around, and I was just like, I had this overwhelming sense of dread. Oh, and that was the creepiest point. I don't even think I mentioned it. I drew eyes. Like, not real, like, descriptive eyes. I drew eye holes in the thing, and I couldn't see that in the darkness, but for some reason, I drew it with eyes. We had our, our golden retriever, Buddy, there, not Chica, Buddy, uh, who's an awesome dog that you guys have probably seen videos of and pictures of. Uh, I, I called the Buddy, and I just had to go lay on the couch. I think, like, I called out to Buddy, because I didn't want to move, and, uh, yeah. So, yeah, that's, uh, that's my other nightmare story. I've got a few others like that. I don't know if you guys want to hear them, though. Oh, boy, okay, okay, all right, then. My parents dragged me over here with my little sister, but I'd rather be on my bike with my friends. You're my little sister, by the way. Fuck you. All right, then. Sure. Hello, Dad, is that you? There's my girl! Made any friends today? No, not at all. Oh, hi! Your dress looks almost the same as mine. We should be friends. Okay, should we? I'll do that, okay. Oh, hey. Ugh. Hello there! I'm the cat! Do you like to play games? I know I do! We have a couple of minutes before today's show starts! Do you wanna play hide and seek with me? Sure. Yay! You hide, then I'll count! Alrighty then. Maybe I could hide in here. Hide in the closet? Hell yeah! Hey! Ah, nice try! I gotcha! Yeah. <laughs> All right then, that cat's good. The cat's real good. Okay. So anyway, 
That's all the time. Oh, it's the cat there now. That's the cat. I noticed by the cat eyes is different. I have bad news. I think the cat is lurking around tonight. You have to be extra careful now. The monster cat is very sneaky, you see. He'll probably try to get you from behind. Check around each end of your bed as often as you can. He could appear from either the very left or the very right side. The flashlight thing will work on him too, so remember to be extra sharp tonight. When the shadow cat is here, your time in the darkness will be short. Do not waste your time for when it runs out, he'll find you. I just don't know what that means. There's nothing on the bed. I don't know what that means. Uh oh. Oh, that's a slow tick. I think I'm good. Oh, alrighty then. Yeah. Ah! Fucking, I didn't expect you to be there, douche nozzle! Yeah, but whoop dee I'm crossing the barrier. No one can stop me. Please don't stop me. Don't stop me. Don't stop me. Ah! Fucking fuck you! Whoa! I right did it! Whoa! The monsters will knock on the doors when they become angry. But they only knock on one of the doors that they're not at. Monsters always try to fool you. Ah, hello. Hey, I found arcade game three. Part one. Part one. Where did I come from? Where to go? Where to come from? Can I go? Hey, Bob, me, my ba da bo, I ba di ba da ba do, ba 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 but that was many years ago. I probably don't matter anymore. You should move along in your life. If you have anything to say, say it now. I, I mean, hello, I guess. I, I, don't, I don't know what to say exactly. The only other thing to do that I can think of would be to let the time run out. I don't know what that's gonna mean, but might as well give it a go, so see you in a few minutes. Five, four, three, two, one! That's it? Alright, okay. Alright, so I can't seem to find anything else and I don't want to spend forever just wandering in the darkness. So, I've got one half of the arcade game and I found a toy. I don't know what else to do. If I really need to, I guess I could go back, but without a map I'm gonna be kind of lost. So, just gotta do what I can against the monster cat now! You guys apparently want more nightmare stories. Don't know why, but I got a lot of them. As a kid, I would have a lot of lucid dreams, like a lot of lucid dreams. I used to be able to lucid dream pretty much whenever I wanted to. When I was a kid, I was able to just fly around and oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Hey, fuck, I didn't expect you to be in the middle. And I, I would be playing around with my brother or something or uh, in the dream, of course, I'd be playing around with my brother and then like I was able to control it, and you know, for some reason I didn't recognize that my brother wasn't also dreaming with me, you know, he obviously was in there, but in the dream I thought he was. And then, I would turn around and he'd be gone. Yeah. Hey, okay, hello, hidey 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 ho. And then I would be in the backyard alone, and then suddenly, like, I knew I was dreaming, but I couldn't control it anymore. Like, tried to fly, couldn't do it. Oh, frick a dick. I forgot that I was in control, and then control was completely ripped from me, and I was just wandering endlessly in the creek, like over and over and over again, endlessly, everywhere I went, looking for my brother, calling out for him, crying, like I was just, I was just completely distraught that my brother was gone because it, it, it's like this transition of mind where you believe the dream is a dream and then suddenly the dream is real. And it was just, ah, it was terrifying. I woke up from that and I had to go like check on my brother to make sure he was still there, not outside, lost in the woods. Oh no, don't do that to me! No! Don't you fucking dare. Ah! Ah, I caught ya! Ha ha, I guessed it! Ah, okay. Alright, geez, that was stressful. I don't know why. Huh, having that cat in the room doesn't make me any happier. Oh, hey, yeah. Hello there, kid. I'm the puppeteer. Normally, my friend Vinny is with me, but he's resting right now. Maybe you'll get to meet him after today's show if you want to. Hi, sweetie. Have you met the puppeteer? He's here early today. Okay, if you 
say so. I already beat my old high score on all the games. Not like I could ever use those skills for anything useful. I wonder if you could get paid for playing games in the future. Huh. This kid seems to have a, a grasp on things in life, but no, absolutely not. Oh no. Hey, it's my little pal. Early for the show as usual. Up for another round of hide and seek. What happens if I say no? Don't be sad because I won't last time. Tell me if you change your mind, all right? Up for another round. How about yes? Nito, you hide again, then I'll count. Alrighty then. What about the table right under my dad? Dad, protect me! There's a crazy rat! Boo! Okay, got you. Gotcha again. I don't know if there's any way to win that. I doubt it anyway. You're remembering more and more. Just look at your room. You barely remembered it before. I have a feeling that you'll be able to get rid of those nightmares soon. Just keep fighting. Then I'm sure you'll beat them for good. Oof. Oof. God damn it, I can't get anywhere. Nah. That's I I just can't get anywhere. I don't even see any other road. Man, that sucks. Okay, I guess I can't go anywhere. That's super weird. Why? Every other night I've been able to go everywhere, but the rat is just absolutely breathing down my neck. All right, you assholes. Let's see what you're made of. What's that? Hey, 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 back off a little bit more than that, ooh. Ah, uh, what is that? Hey. Howdy, 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 oh, I think there's a cat there. Hi, oh God, look at the goddamn cat. Hi, what the fucking, fucking, fucking God. Whoa. Why? Whoa, where? Why? What the fucking what? What? Fuck you! Why? I thought the knocks came from the opposite! That's what I was instructed! Fuck you! Ugh. God. I think that cat. M oh, hey, hi, cat. That cat. That cat. That one right there. It must, uh. Must get a little, uh. You know, excited, a little more mustard in its step whenever it, uh, knows the rat's about. Oh, it knows what the rat's about. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. oh, where's my- Hey, where's my thing? Where's my thing? Where's my thing? Where's my thing? Oh, no! Uh I wanted to test an idea that I had, which was, I'm running, um, so maybe the answer is not to run, because when you run, you drippy drop the splip splops, and that's why there's a timer, because that would make more sense as to you taking your time out in the darkness. Oh, I just saw the rat! It was just sitting in the darkness! So that must be... Woo. Why? Hey, no! Ah, shitty tits. I shouldn't have walked in front of its face. That was my first mistake. The dream trees will show you the path. Will they now? There's nothing on the back. Alrighty then. Will they show me the path? I hope so. Oh, hey, oh, okay, alright. There's a lot of rats in these dark woods. Huh? Rats? Huh? Ah! I'm okay. All right, everybody, calm down. That was not. Did not warrant panic of that degree. Okay, I made it. Where am I now? Ooh, hello. Alrighty then. Give, 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 give. I found arcade game number three, part two. So it was in a different zone. I wasn't gonna be able to get that no matter what I did. Ah! I didn't see that. Okay, you know what? I got what I needed to get. I got the arcade game. And so, you guys have also been telling me that I need to play the goddamn arcade games. So once I beat the shit out of this night, which I'm gonna do, huh, huh, yeah, I'm gonna play me some arcade games. What was that? Hi. Oh, hey, how's it going there? friend do. So I was comfortable and I got eyes peering at me from the darkness. So either shut your eyes, pull them out, or go fuck yourself. Bloop. Bloop. Ah, frick. 
Under my bed? How can this be? Can I stop it mid-recording and... I can. You know, just to time out exactly when I need to actually redo the thing. You do schnozzles need to tone it down a little bit. I'm at 5 a.m. and I'm gonna get out of here! Yay! I made it! Okay, so now when I get into this goddamn arcade, I can actually play these goddamn games. Supposedly, I don't 100% know. Astro Pinball. Jungle Pinball. Whack-a-mole. Hi again. I didn't get to be here the past two days. Were the shows good? I bet they were. At least I get to be here to celebrate Vinny's birthday. I'm really excited. Who the heck is Vinny? And also, why can't I play arcade games? Hello there. On the card, do you like to play games? Hi. What? You're saying we've met already? Impossible. I know I'd remember that cute little face anyway. Anyway, there's a few minutes till the show starts. You wanna play hide and seek with me? I don't know if this cute little face wants to play hide and seek with you. Yeah, sure. Yay! You hide. And I'll count. You know what? I'm gonna hide under the coffee table because I need some Joe here to get through the night. Little kid has sleep deprivation. It's probably not good for me. I supplement with caffeine. Boo! Hi. <laughs> nice try. All right, sure. One day I'll get these. Maybe. Probably not. All right. We're gonna try this. We're gonna keep going. We're gonna try it. And if it works, it. It'll work. The actors playing the rat and the cat in the theater show were horribly murdered. Oh, found dead in the staff room by the actor playing the puppeteer. One actor was under the influence and died of strangling his opponent with the rim under the, on the underside of the head of the costume. The costume heads were airtight, and the actors had to get air through the gap around the costume's neck. Okay. Oh, hey. Well, that's terrifying. So why did that happen? Why did they strangulate themselves? All right, tonight's the final night before you get to see him again. It's been an entire week, but tomorrow he'll probably have a solution to these horrible nightmares. Okay, just one more night. Okay, I trust you 100% with my life because I feel like that's what I'm doing right now. All righty, then I can handle this. Uh oh, that ain't good. Uh oh. Ah, oh, shit. Oh, no! Oh, no! Ah, oh, god damn it. Okay, hi there. This is the fifth night, and according to the name, this is gonna be the last one. So I'm gonna beat these guys' faces in, and then slap them with their own corpses. Don't ask me how I'm gonna do that. Not today. You can bang all you want. It ain't gonna happen. Huh? This room is a bang-free zone. Whoa, hey, buddy boo. Ah, that ain't good. That's, uh, that's bad. Oh, you came out of nowhere. You weren't there before. Where'd you come from? Where did you go? Good night, Joe, you give me a goddamn straight answer. For once in your goddamn life. Oh, no. Gotta play double duty here. Oh, fucking no! I thought I could play double duty. Uh oh. Oh! Okay. Now, what weird cutscene is gonna happen now? Can I go in here now? Yet? Fine. Today's the day with the surprise show. Excited to see what it's about? No, Dad, because apparently it's going to be deadly. Ooh, all the kids are so excited. I'm gonna go over here first, though. Okay, nothing. All right. Hi! Hey, 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 calm down, guys. Hey, I have an idea. Let's all play hide and seek together! I'll stay here and count to 100 while you all hide. Ready, set, and go! Oh, okay. Huh? Didn't you hear what I said? You have to hide! We'll find a hiding spot! Okay. Whoa! The fuck? The fuck? Whoa! It's Winnie! Oh, Vinnie! Ah. Hide in the closet? Maybe not. It's the script for today's show. They are going to reveal the rat and cat's names. It says here the cat's real name is... Candy? Candy the cat. I kinda like it. Oh! I'm gonna hide in this closet. This is gonna go good for me. I saw you walk in here, kid. I'm gonna find ya! 
What are you thinking? You can't show up here in that condition. Relax, man. I only had a few. Do you have any idea what would happen? If any of the parents found out that one of our actors is drunk? Think of our careers. Think of the children. What about the children? They love me. I'm the most popular character in this freaking show. Don't be jealous that I've gotten talent and you don't. Take off that costume. You're going home. No, I'm going to go back out there and keep this damn show alive. No, you're not. Take it off. No. Oh, oh, oh. Uh-oh. Cut it out! Uh-oh. Ugh. Yeah. Okay. Whoa, hey. Ugh. Yeah. Let. Me. Go! Ow. Dead. Uh-oh. Hey. Hey! Bluff! Bluff, are you okay? Come on, man, this isn't funny. That blood isn't funny. Oh no, 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 no. Uh oh. What's with all the. Oh! Ah! What happened? Lock the door! I. I didn't mean to. It was an accident. I swear. We just. He. We have to call an ambulance and. And the police. We have to tell them what happened. No, wait. Blank was always a bit unstable. He'd been drinking. We found him like this. Yes. Yeah, yeah, that's what it was. Yeah, that's what we have to tell them. We found him dead in here. Listen, it was an accident. An honest mistake. We have to tell them what really happened. But I can't. I'll have to kill you too to make you silent. Yeah, that's a good move. Yeah, it's always the best move to do that. What are you, what are you doing? I can't breathe. Oh, boy. Yeah, I was just joking about the kill him too thing. That was a joke. You didn't have to do that. That was... That was the opposite of what should have been. Uh, yeah, take one second to stare at the diploma for a bit. Hello? Police? You have to hurry over here. My coworkers, they, they're dead. Both of them. I just... I heard something. It sounded like a rustle. I just came in and they were both dead in here. Oh boy. Wait, what, why'd you take the diploma? Why'd you take the acting diploma? Are you sure that's what happened? It's okay, Mary. You remember now, and that's good. Now that you remember, do you still think it was your fault? You weren't the reason he did what he did. He did those things because of himself. I'll help you. You're not alone in this. You don't have to be afraid anymore. You don't have to fear them, and you don't have to fear him either. The truth ending. Mary has definitely improved, and she's finally remembering what happened. It's exactly what I thought. Mary had experienced something on the same day as the incident. Her nightmares stemmed from that same incident somehow. Her unconscious mind blocked her memories of the experience, leaving only the fear left. Except I never imagined it would have been such a disturbing experience. Mary witnessed the incident from inside a closet in the same room. She remembers it all clearly now. She was even able to describe the layout of the room with detail. I recommend that Mary should keep seeing once a week until she's fully recovered from her traumatization. Miss Sherwood, could you please schedule a meeting with the authorities for me ASAP? I need to talk to whoever handled the case. They need to hear Mary's statements, tell them what she was a witness, and that they should consider reopening the case. Okay, all right then. Ah, wait, final night and then extra. What does it mean though? Let me check out the extra first before I go to the final night. Oh! Well, okay. Ooh! Hi, Candy! Oh, look! Candy's getting food. Oh, no! Candy's gonna die! Oh, hi. Oh, it's Pangu! Let me try this final night. Let me try it. I, I don't know if I'm gonna beat it this time. Oh. Hey, how's it going? Why did you return here? The secret's out. The weight of your guilt has been erased. So why did you return here? I had everything. Yeah. And if then you took it away, you don't get to walk away from what you've done to me. You've ruined my life. And now, I will make sure. You'll 
never be able to sleep again. Hey, ah, boo, ah, spooky. Okay. Alrighty then, the final night. Alright, Vinny, come on. Come at me if you can. Okay, Vinny, come on out. Hey, fucking fuck you, dude. Oh god, oh god, oh god, hi. Okay, so, oh my god, what was that? Oh fuck, that's hard to deal with. Ah, oh, fucking fucking fuck, what the fuck? Okay, alright, you calm down there, Sonny Jim. Okay, I guess that's it then. Uh, I guess. Hi, Vinny. Okay, hi. Mm. Hi, Vinny. Alright, okay. Alright, alrighty then. Well, hi. Hey, oh, I thought I had that. I thought I was doing great. Okay then. Fuck you. All right. Anyway, so that is all the time I got for Five Nights of Candies. There is some more to do here, and Vinny seems to be a bit of a challenge here. And there are more things to unlock. I did miss one of the arcade games to play in the menu here. So there's a whole bunch of other stuff, and maybe I've got one more episode to do to conquer Vinny once and for all and see what the rest of these things are. But until then... Thank you, everybody, so much for watching. Let me know what you think down in the comments below. And as always, I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye!